morning everybody how are you guys doing <laughs> hey <laughs> good chat the batmobile's back the batmobile has been returned to us with the keys you've probably been wondering where it's been but you if you watch all the other videos you'll know that we lost the key and there was a big drama and the car ended up being shipped to Vienna with the spare key and now it is back and it is ready to join us on today's part of our drive back to London. We are currently in Vienna, just outside our hotel in Vienna and ready to head towards, I think, Switzerland today. Someone just asked me where we were going and I genuinely had no idea. Where are we going today? Switzerland, via Germany. No? Okay, we're not going to Germany, we're going to Switzerland, <laughs> so yay. But the Batmobile's with us and it's going to be a crazy drive. We've been joined also by the Men in Brabus team uh, in their 4x4 squared, which is pretty flipping badass. Here we go guys, we are ready to depart. Maisie's in the car with me again. And it is a beautiful sunny day, so we're taking the roof off. And we have 6 hours and 26 minutes of driving today. Being led by the massive D-Wagon, following Sam in his Porsche. And we've got James behind, followed by the Batmobile and the Mercedes. Bye bye, Vienna. The Batmobile next to us now. Pretty beastly. It's so big. Supercar traffic. <laughs> Five minutes, and we have already been stopped by the police. Probably because I just want to look at the map here. Another idea. First petrol stop. Then the people's reaction was pretty priceless. It was their mouths open. Yeah, they saw us come in, and they were like, oh. "Anyways, so got this. These dudes behind, Batmobile with their music blasting." Let's get these cars filled up, ready to head to Switzerland. One of the things you have to do at petrol stops is clean all the windscreens. So it's, the teams are out cleaning everyone's windscreen. Ah oh, yes, here he is, Rich getting the Porsche. And then the G-Wagon, casually blocking everyone. staying together and stuff so far um, so we're all together and we've decided in the end when we saw some mountains to deviate from the motorway and <laughs> we got phones and cameras falling all over the place around the corners there um, deviate from the motorway to hit some mountain roads so I think that's where we're going now my sat nav is a boy band yes that actually is a thing yeah I'm not sure where we're going exactly because these guys decided um, but we shall see I'm just kind of following the pack if you look in front now, you'll see we've got a pretty cool lineup, and right behind us as well is the Batmobile.
Oh, this is zoomed in, isn't it? Oh, that's the wrong way. Okay, we have been driving and been on the road for ages. I'm also not wearing any shoes right now. Took them off to drive because they were a bit tight. So, have you been having a good drive? Good, Today's been a good day, hasn't it? Yeah, it's my ears blocked, so I don't know what <laughs> That would be the tunnels. As you guys saw, the tunnels are pretty loud. The weather's been alright. It started raining a bit, so we had to put the roof back on the car. But nothing too, too dramatic. My back, I'm not gonna lie to you, is starting to get pretty sore after all these miles in the car. Um, we're just gonna do a cheeky little fill up now. And then onwards to... Where are we going? Does anyone know where we're going? What? Really? No, Switzerland, no? Uppendale. 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 We're going to Uppendale, um, which, should, which should be fun. We were literally just driving and found this random awesome spot to take photos. So Rich over there is on the roof of the 4x4 and all the cars are going to line up. Maisie has been driving for the last couple of, well, about half an hour. And also, check out where Baxter is now. Baxter's been strapped to the back of the Porsche. We're going to need to get him back before tonight. Yeah. Thing. This is amazing. We are driving through some incredible roads with all of the cars. Check this out. Sam is lining up there. Probably to take some photos. Hello, everyone. Maisie's driving still. All good. Look at that, guys. These views are incredible. This place is unbelievable. Turns out we're 10 minutes away now, and look at this, we're literally in a forest. And we're still climbing. We're still, still climbing. climbing. We're going to need to keep an eye oh on the bears the tonight. Drop. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a wee were. Oh my god. That is beautiful. Well, we've arrived, and I'm zoomed in again, I keep doing this. Uh, there we go. Okay, we've been handed champagne, and we've come to this place, Maybach. I had no idea we were even coming here, but there's some sick cars around. We've parked all of our cars up, which look amazing. And then there's this old three, old 300 SL Goldwing and a Maybach in here, well out here, sorry. Look at that interior. Those aren't the original seats or steering wheel. Whoa, actually, what the hell? That's been completely redone. That is badass. <laughs> then in here, Sterling Moss, flipping Maybachs over there. This old Merc, which looks stunning. SLR convertible. How cool is this? This is unbelievable. This is I think amazing. I've been around every car in the world. I've probably driven almost every car in the world. You show up here in the middle of the mountains in Switzerland. They got a Sterling Moss. Every car here is impeccable. It's unbelievable. I had no, I didn't even know this was happening, but it is. And Tommy, what's the best news of the day? I get to eat. No, we get. I also get to drink, but I haven't eaten since breakfast, which is more important to me right now than drinking, which is very <laughs> rare to say. This is one of the last Mybex 62S built out of the series. It's called the Swarovski version. It's all set with handmade Swarovski crystals in the headdress, and in combination with the silver carbon inside and the silver shoulder line oh and the headlights also are made in AMG raw silver. The same color as we see outside on the 300 SL going. This is unbelievable. We need to do gumball in this, man. Like, comfortable. Get someone called Hamish to drive us. Oh, I tell you something, guys. And it's a drone in the house. Charge it fast enough. That's pretty yeah. cool. Probably going to get some cool shots. What do you think of this? What do I think of this? Well, as you've just spoken on my video, I have no word. The vocabulary doesn't come out with the, the goods that I'm looking for. You know. Wow, I'm impressed that you got that click. Do you like that? Like, yeah, you I spent some time in Africa knowing the sentence and no effort. Mobile. <laughs> There's an SLS. Says it all. E electric drive. Wow. <laughs> that is madness. These things. I've wow. never really seen one of these. I saw one in Monaco once, a white one. Um, the E cell, I think it's they're called. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So we're about to feel some pure acceleration from an electric SLS. AMG SLS electric drive, one of eight. One of eight. Wow, where we were. Ciao. That is so fast <laughs> and so instantaneous. And there's no noise. Go. Oh. 
hurt to it hurts it hurts your face when the acceleration kicks in that is genuinely i've never is felt that anything like it that is g-force and a half that is i'm so badly thank you so much <laughs> there are not many people who can experience this because yeah. not there's only eight cars in the world oh man i feel and lucky the people who have them don't drive them and now you guys have experienced it too Unbelievable. No, hug, it hugs it. It's like you're glued to the ground going, I don't know why. Like <laughs> not trying to keep up with the speed here, but just my own life and safety, but this is out of control. Look at the smile on his face. Good? <laughs> this is the fastest smart in the world. Electric Brabus smart. Do you like it? This thing is incredible. There's no noise. <laughs> I'm barely accelerating. <laughs> I kid you not. <laughs> See, I ended up not remembering to finish that vlog. However, if you want to find out how I've ended up in the car with Sam here, yeah, you're going to have to watch the next upcoming vlogs. Um, they should be coming daily. I'm hoping if I have time to upload them. Anyways, that was a really good day. And yeah, thank you for watching as per usual. Please remember to subscribe and I'll see you soon. Cheers. Bye. And I've got Maisie with me here, who's actually going to be starting a YouTube channel too. She's yeah. just preparing it and who has been helping me with the driving. So you did the first leg. Yeah. I've just taken over and we are literally driving through the middle of nowhere. It's That'd insane. Cows on the road. Cows on the road. Yeah, I mean, cows. And basically it's like a little overtaking game that we're playing. So there are loads of trucks and it's sort of like a single lane road. We're on for about 50 miles, so obviously you don't want to stay stuck behind a truck.